Well, the key to growth, I have to say, this is a really difficult question to answer. Um, the reason that some companies have grown um, will be different from the reason that other companies have grown. And um, every organization grows for specific reasons. Uh, maybe they grow at different rates in different marketplaces, but they grow normally because the leadership of the organization and the team around them within the business have got some sort of a common goal. They're working collaboratively together to, to work to those goals. And those goals might be super ambitious or they might be moderately ambitious financially. They might be really ambitious from the point of view of creating a fantastic uh, cultural environment, but not so focused on making a huge amount of increased turnover or profit uh, or ROI on their business. But so I put together just a short list of things I think that are key to growth across a broad range of businesses with a multiple range of objectives in terms of what growth really means. There's a short list here. I think it's a balance of things like working capital management and working capital optimization. And those of course both lead to what your goals are for the business and what the what you mean by optimization will depend on what you're really trying to achieve in the business. I think it's really important to try things out. Uh, I personally have tried lots of different initiatives in a lot of other organizations and my own businesses over many years. The first guy to put uh, a number of different technologies into the marketplace in communications and networking, et cetera, and also in recruitment adoption of new technology. You've got to try things out all the time and be prepared to fail. So trying things out is the second thing. The third thing is collaboration within a business and engagement of staff. That's really, really important as well, without going into too much detail on that. Determination and tenacity are very, very important for a business. There are going to be a lot of downs as well as ups in a business. We all know what it's like to run an organization and to be management, managing a desk of our own within a business with the targets, responsibilities of that. Determination and tenacity are really key attributes of everybody inside the business. Leadership development is also incredibly important in all areas of that, not just simply sales skills or account development skills, all areas of leadership development. Um, encouraging initiative is also incredibly important. There's a lot more initiative and competency within every person working in every company than we ever get to find or exploit. So encouraging as much initiative as possible, fresh ideas is very, very important, keeping ahead of the competition. And then finally, the very big companies have got a huge scale would say that their process vigor is really important. So once you've got a good process that works really well, make sure you stick to it. But being flexible enough to change the overall corporate process um, direction um, when things do change in the marketplace or new opportunities come to adopt new technologies within the business. But process vigor across the business, what you mean by what you say when you do things is very, very important too. So I hope that covers it. It's a very short, uh, quick skim over the key things that I think that make companies grow very fast or to meet the objectives of the company owners and founders.